Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to BSOD Gaming. With the recent implementation of 60 FPS into CMU and The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we have seen massive strides in the modding of FPS and FPS caps. In this video, I am going to show you how you can disable the 60 FPS cap and display up to 240 FPS in game as long as your hardware can push that amount of frames, which to be honest, no CPU GPU combination in this day and age will be able to do so. It must also be noted guys that in order to actually display and show these extra frames on your monitor, it must have a refresh rate of above 60 Hz. If it does not have a refresh rate of above 60 Hz, you will literally not be able to display those extra frames on your screen. However, with the popularity of high refresh rate monitors on the rise in the PC gaming community, I am now going to show you how you can disable the 60 FPS cap and enable 240 FPS playback. It must also be noted guys that similarly to the 60 FPS patch when it first released, this patch is in a very experimental stage of its development. All credit for this pack's creation goes to Discord user Epigram who has created this and is actively working on it as we speak. The installation and activation is very simple. All you need to do is come to this link and download this graphics pack. Once the pack is downloaded, let's go over to where it is held. Mine is on my desktop, all I need to do is right click on this and click extract here. Once we have this pack, all we need to do is open up our CMU 1.10.0 folder, open up the graphics pack folder and drop this file right here. Now all we need to do is come back to the previous folder and launch CMU. Once CMU is launched, you want to navigate to the graphics pack folder and you want to enable the newly added Breath of the Wild FPS plus plus 240 hertz edition. You can turn off the other FPS plus plus if you have it. Once you have this done, close your window and you can launch your game. And there we go. As you can see, we are now in a major test of strength shrine and we are going well above the 60 FPS limit. However, we are still constrained by hardware limitations. For anybody who is interested, I have left my performance analytics at the top right hand corner of this video. My system specs are listed down in the description below. And for anybody interested, the graphics packs I used in this playthrough are the 1440p graphics pack, contrasty, anti-aliasing removal, higher resolution shadows and the 240 hertz fps plus plus graphics pack that is linked in the description as always guys cheers for checking out the video i hope you found it useful and will experiment with this and test it out remember to like it if you liked it dislike it if you didn't and subscribe to the channel if you want to see all future videos from me